Hello, welcome to the new vlog. I actually posted the last studio vlog yesterday and people have been so kind and I reached 2,000 subscribers this morning. Ah, thank you so much. Um, I really appreciate all your like kind words and comments and support. And it was so nice seeing when people like posted photos of them watching it on their Instagram stories because everyone could see what they were doing whilst watching it and I felt like it was so cool. But um, yeah, I'm excited to continue filming and make more and create more videos and content. Hopefully I will be more consistent or at least be able to keep posting on a regular basis. But um, yeah, currently today I'm wearing comfy clothes. I'm actually wearing jogging bottoms and a hoodie because I didn't know what to get dressed, like what to wear. I find getting dressed in the mornings now to be the hardest part almost. <sighs> First world problems, I know. But I just never know what to wear in the mornings and especially when it gets so cold now, all I wanna be is just like, cozy and wear something comfortable since I'm just sat on my desk mostly working all day. So, unless I'm actually going outside to like post orders or something, I don't tend to get dressed very suitably. But um, yeah, so this morning I was just like looking at sketchbook stuff. I actually brought up, hang on. I brought my Monstera up into the house so it's like behind me at my desk now. So now I have like a plant buddy in my background, it's, although it gets like overexposed from the windows. But it's so nice to have like some greenery behind me. And the that, that leaf, oh wait, look. Look how big that leaf is, that makes me so happy. Although um, it has been eaten by some snails. It was in my like our, like shed before, but um, I wanted it to be in, the, in our house because it's getting cold now. And I wanted to be able to like keep it, like upkeep it better. Upkeep it, that's not the word. Like look after it better, I guess. But um, yeah, I'm hoping it can grow to be healthy and be happy, but. Yeah, it's nice to have some greenery. <laughs> I was gonna say, also, the clay vase I made last time, I made like a cute, I, put, I mean, I put a little like sprig of, as I was saying, I cut a sprig of baby's breath or gypsophilia, it's also known as, to put in the clay vase I made. And it kind of looks really cute. I was, I've had it on sitting up here with the rest of the clay and in the sun it looks really pretty so this was actually for my 16th birthday i am now 20 so it's lasted four years because it's dried out and it lasts like a long time when it's dried out i can't tell if this is nice or not the rainbow is from a thing i've got hanging in my window but um maybe i should oh see that's better lighting but my plants in the way not the best angle but i got my hair roots re-bleached this morning at the hairdressers. I also tried the Greg's vegan festive, the festive vegan bake. It wasn't as good as I hoped. I do prefer the vegan steak bakes more, but they don't sell those anymore. So it's hard. Um, I'm currently watching Paloma. And I also, I mean, yesterday I made some more clay things that I'm going to try out. Like this is going to be a, can you see this? It's like a um, cat, oh god the lighting is awful, cat um, decoration so i'm gonna paint that soon once it's dry and i've got a few other bits that i'm gonna try I found Brewster! Finally! I've been looking for him for a while. Now I can get the cafe! Yee. Looking on some new stickers when the postman rang the doorbell and he gave me this. So I'm excited for this. I've been waiting for this for like over a month. I think. But it's from Mini Gallery Box and it is... Oh my gosh! Oh it's in like a nice folder! It's this GCP's collaboration with Mini Gallery Box and this is so pretty. I went for the full like print set with the zine and the stickers and the print and I'm so excited to get this mini gallery box 
they have their Instagram account and they work, do collaborations with lots of artists. Look at everything. So, okay, so all the stickers are in here. Then we've got the zine and then we've got the prints as well. This is so pretty. Oh. There's also a really big print too. Oh, I have no idea where I'm going to put these. I really like this one. The colours are so pretty. I'm very happy I got all three. Yeah, I'm so happy with this. Everything looks amazing. I can't wait to like read through the zine. And I think I might have to buy Palomas now because it's so cute. Ugh. I love it. Good morning. It's the 29th of November today. It's Monday. So new week. And today I'm going to be packing some orders. I have like four orders that I need to pack. So not too many. And then I want to aim to get them sent out to the post office today. And then I want to go, kind of want to go to the charity shop to see if they have any winter coats. Because it's four degrees. Or maybe no, maybe colder. Four degrees. <clears throat> four degrees is the highest temperature it's going to be today. So I bet it's already like two degrees currently. There's like frost everywhere. All the roofs and cars, like windows are all frosted up. So um, yeah, I'm going to pack some orders right now and try and get them done before lunchtime. And so I can go to the post office, go to the charity shop and go to Sainsbury's. But yay. Um, we'll go to And I just put some hand cream on. This is the Love and Plums Body Shop hand cream. It smells so nice. My friend had it at university, and so I've been waiting to buy it because it only comes out at Christmas, I think, or something. Yeah, I'm putting off going outside because it's so cold. But I'm just gonna get ready now. Going very brown today. I've got my brown checkered trousers on. I might wear a brown coat as well. We'll see. Hmm. I just remembered. I was just about to get ready to go outside, and then I remembered, and all the parcel is coming for me between 11:03 and one o'clock which is an annoying time because i want to go out just now before lunch but i guess i'm going to have to wait till it arrives because it's a christmas present and i don't want to miss it i'm, I'm trying to try and see my friends this week i need to confirm with her but i might be going to her uni flat to stay the night with her so that'll be fun <laughs> so i'm just getting ready to leave to go to the post office and to the charity shop I'm gonna wear a scarf because it's cold. I haven't worn this jacket in so long. It's a denim jacket. I got it from Gap originally. And I'm going to put all these in here. Uh, will they fit in? Hopefully they will. I'm gonna wear a beanie too. I haven't worn a beanie in so long. <laughs> I don't know if this looks okay. 
Oh, maybe not with the scarf. I think I look better without. Maybe I just broke two BBs. I think I'm ready to go. <laughs> Yay! Oh, I've got my Doc Martin boots. back from the post office and the charity shop and I actually found some things this time normally I find the things that I'm, I'm like unsure about and then I end up leaving them because I'm like ugh don't think I actually want to spend my money on this to then regret it you know and this time I found some gloves I've been looking for some like mittens for a while and I found some like cheap ones online but I wasn't sure and I couldn't decide which ones I wanted and then I saw these in, like, in the shop and they're like good quality ones they're like really fluffy and warm on the inside which made me get end up getting them because um so it keeps them warm and they're orange well terracotta -y red and then the second thing i got was this basket i got it for to put tape in as you can see so i have like a better method to like feed stickers and tape through i saw this actually from um apple cheeks tiffany she had like a, um, a basket that she put like wire on top to like put tape through and she had like a rod through the middle i need to get like some sort of stick to shove in between like three of the holes to keep them in place but I think that will be handy and I can, like when I get more stickers to put on orders, I can put them through here and I can just have that on my desk. I might spray colour, spray paint the colour, spray paint the colour, spray paint it a different colour because I mean it's like, it's it's a pink but it's like not a great pink, it's like a flesh coloured pink and I kind of want like a peachy pink or maybe like red, I don't know if red would be great, green, maybe green actually, like a limey green. That could be cute. I don't really have much green in my area, so yeah, even orange, you know, it's always good to be doing orange. But yeah, I'm looking at what like work well to have my shelf for now, so and this was only a pound, so I thought that was a good steal, you know. The leaves curl up and brown. The birds find warmer ground And every willow finds its pillow Waves relinquish sound Although the skies turn cold And breezes follow suit I'm nervous today because I have a call with important businessy people today and um, a couple months ago, I don't know if a few people saw me on Instagram I and TikTok, I worked with Samsung to um, display their Galaxy tablet and the new phone, the Z Flip phone. I think it's the Z Flip phone? I'm pretty sure it's the Z Flip phone. Um, but I have a call with the agency people again today which I am nervous for. So hopefully, fingers crossed, it goes well. I guess I have the call in like half an hour with them. And it's always the bit before the call that's the worst bit because I get stressed out and I'm worried I'm gonna like say something stupid or make a bad impression. But considering that they contact me back, I think I must have, must have made a good impression last time. So I'm happy that went well, but yeah, wish me luck guys. Besties, the call went well. They liked my ideas and sketches, so I'm kind of getting free range on the project since it's just for a pitch. So I'm, I need to kind of start filming today. I have to make a TikTok video, time lapse, draw the sketch and take some photos to get started on doing that today. Just kind of like need to film the process. It's annoying though because it's like a dark grey day, so the lighting is not great, but let's hope for the best. I mean, it's only going to get darker over the day because it gets dark at like 3pm, so... Gonna have to start filming soon, like now. And actually, I kind of want to eat first. It's 10.50 and I haven't had anything to eat. So, gonna make a bagel and then start doing this filming. Yay.
new day, same angle, because the lighting from the window is here, so it makes sense. Um, <laughs> my cat just climbed over the fence, and she never jumps over the fence. She doesn't like high things up, so now I'm worried that she might get stuck in next door's garden without being able to get back over the fence. But I guess we'll find out later. She, <laughs> She's a cat, she can jump over the fence. Anyway, um, plans for today, I'm going to be packing orders, I, got, I have six to pack. And then, um, also, I'm going to be drawing a new post for Instagram. Kind of want to do that first, but I know I should be packing orders first. I brought down my Spider-Man Into the Spider-Verse art book, because I got this. And they announced part one of the new film recently, and it looks so good. I'm so excited. This is probably my most watched film ever. I just love the animation. I think it's so clever. And I just love the characters, the music, the soundtrack. Just the... Oh, Everything was so well done, and I don't think it got the praise it deserved. But yeah, I got the art book, and I love like looking through this and all the sketches and the, like the thought process behind it all and the landscapes. It's amazing. It blows me away every time I look at it, and I'm, I'm so excited for the next film. And because it's part part one, it means we're gonna get part two, which means there's gonna be three Spider Verse films in total, which I I'm so excited for. Yeah, I did some sketches yesterday as well. Should I show you? I was just sketching some more cats and some houses, and I also, let me turn the page if I can, I was drawing, I did draw Little Women, it was like kind of in my old style, but um, yeah, I just wanted to try it out, and then I started doing some like thumbnail sketches, and I want to draw this one today, it says keep going, I'm rooting for you, and it's a cat looking in the mirror like pointing at itself. finished doing the six order pack packing the six orders millie came back in oh me she looks amazing um but yeah so now i think i'm going to do the instagram post that i was planning on drawing today and um i was kind of considering doing a live stream but i've never done a live stream before and i'm not sure if i'm like in a talkative mood so i don't know how like interactive i would be so maybe i might just leave that for now and then do that another day so but it's on my list to do. Like, I have a to-do list of an, in a notebook, and that's one of the things I want to take off at some point. So, you will see. And I also don't know whether to do it on TikTok, like, whether more people would watch on there, since I have more followers on there. But then would more people watch on Instagram, because I have more, like, followers to do with art on there. I just got three very exciting packages. Um, first, this is this. I think you might recognise this packaging. Oh, yay! I love being one of Paloma's Patreons. Like her stickers are always the cutest every single month. And I'm so excited to get them. Oh, or did she do two stickers? Oh, yes. 
These are so cute. Oh, I love these. Oh, the sun's right on my face. But look how cute they are. Oh, thank you so much, Paloma, if you're seeing this. I really appreciate it. I can't wait to like stick this in my... Should I stick my sketchbook? Or my water bottle? Hmm. I'm going to have to decide at a later point where to put those because I can never decide. But look how cute this is. Look, how, look at the fragile stamp cat and then her return in the dress. Oh, and then the thank you. That, I feel like that's arrived so quickly. It's come all the way from Singapore. Look how cute. So I ordered some socks and some stickers from Ven Sheba, her, or Ven on Instagram. And this is so cute. I was, I've been so excited. Oh, I got some verb socks. Like, I feel like more artists should do socks because socks are such a great thing to like design and I would love to do some in the future. Oh my gosh. You cannot tell me these are not the nicest socks you've ever seen. They've got like pink. I love these. The green shade is so pretty. Thank you so much, Ven. These are gorgeous. I cannot wait, wait to wear these. So yeah, that's her username, Ven Chiba. Then you can scan the QR code to see more of her work, I presume. But this is so cute. Oh, and she gave me an extra sticker. The cherries. And I ordered this sticker. Ven always has the cutest sticker designs, like I always see on her story when she's designing them and I'm like, oh my god, I need to step up my sticker game because of her. Third exciting package was my stickers arrived that I designed. So here is one of the new designs and then this is another one, it's like a photo strip. They came out very yellow, I think it's because I designed them late at night and um, I was trying to make it in time to get the Black Friday deal that was on the website. And so my night shift was on and also I mean I like warm colours, I'm fine with them, but like they're transparent so the confetti and things are all transparent so you can see like behind it. And then I just like these are cute photo strips. <laughs> but yeah, they're the colours are slightly off from what I hoped for, but I think that's my fault, not theirs. So I'm still pleased with them. But yeah, exciting. editing Alice and I was importing all the footage and realised I haven't done an outro so this is what I'm filming here. I currently have Millie on my lap so she is helping me outro this video but she does not want to be in the actual camera but um yeah I hope if I don't upload before Christmas I hope you guys have a good Christmas enjoy your like time with friends and family or just have a nice chill Christmas on your own if you're doing that too um it's been fun to film in the past like four weeks I don't even know how when I started filming for this video but um yeah I, I hope you guys enjoyed the video and i hope to see you guys in the new year or whenever i next post so bye guys and thank you for watching this video bye.